at the Lingoni site, which is um, slightly frustrating because it's it, it's a really difficult walk all the way up. It's about, it took us nearly two hours to get up here. Sometimes you're scrambling up using root systems as ladders, or you're walking along paths just now just wide enough to put one foot. And you're hoping that the ground will hold together. So it's quite relieved to get here. Um, but then when we got here, we were scrambling around a lot to try and find the bats because there's been a landslide right next to the roost and that where that landslide was was where it used to be possible to see the bats from um, but now that all of the land's changed and we're just right underneath the bats and you just get you can get a glimpse of them from underneath but the, the foliage is too thick so we've seen a few bats but we know there are there well there should be over a hundred here but we just have no way of counting them but luckily it's so difficult to get to, there's not much chance of people cutting trees for planks or carrying anything out because well, I struggled with a backpack. It's a beautiful site, it's totally natural forest. We had a, saw a couple of lemurs on the way up that were cutting together and um, been asleep for most of the morning, so that was extra special. So all we can say is that it's a, the site is still intact, the bats are still here but we don't have a clue about how many there are. The Adder Roost is lovely. <laughs> it's not like any all the other walks. Unfortunately, this is the roost that brought my boss to, so now he thinks that all the walking in Anjouan is easy. We've got a good view of the bats, so we're just waiting until it warms up a little bit so we can count them properly. We've had some encouraging news from uh, the uh, member of the village who's accompanied us to the roost site today. Um, he's heard another member of the village talking about another roost a bit further along from here so uh, when we finish the count here we'll go down and have a chat and hopefully find out about another roost to try and get to next week. We've made it to the final roost in Anjouan. We thought we were going to find another roost at Adder. Um, we didn't manage to find it, apparently the trees have already been cut down. So I don't know if it was a story or people getting the wrong type of bats, but but still, so we found 16 roots all together in Anjouan, and here in Nindri, it's a really steep walk to get up here, and it's really quite difficult to get around. The ground's really, really slippery. The soil falls away from underneath your feet, but it's a lovely roost because you get so close to the bats. Unfortunately, in the big storms that happened back in May. One of the second biggest roost tree was blown over, so it snapped right in half. So it was actually two trees that were twined together. So it's left a huge gaping hole in the middle of the roost. And I think previously we found over 40 bats here, and we've only found a maximum of 15 today. And hopefully it's just because it's quite soon after the event, um, since they might come back. The other roost trees and the, the principal roost tree is here. So hopefully they'll come back eventually. <laughs>